So our last race from Cheltenham before next week is race six. It's a stellar handicap hurdle. It's a two mile one furlong with Fent. So Tawny Ayo to Daniel French is number one top weight. The big easy for Joshua Sutherland is two. Baron Scrooge for James Shea is three. Final termination for Paul Rhodes is four. Resurgent Gift for Paul O'Neill is five. Osiris Allah for Thomas Rogers is six. Chatterbury Altos for Ryan Costello is seven. Cycle Glass for Derek Hinton is eight. And Social Butterfly for Thomas Rogers is nine. There's nine of them to go over this two mile and a furlong here. Star has gone away. Here's final termination. It's happily bowled along, although taking a hold now. Again, once again, we've got plenty of reluctant leaders, but pushing right through the pack now in the pink silks of Del Hinton Cycle Glass. It's going to happily take them along to the first of eight hurdles. And this Cycle Glass is going to lead them over it. It's taken a couple of lengths from the rest of the pack, and the purple six out wide is Tornadoes, the top weight. He's been falling down the ratings. Very successful the first couple of weeks. But managed to get a winner in the past three or four. So Daniel French will be looking for better from him this week. But it's Cycle Glass that leads us by about five lengths from 28 Tornidos. Big Easy on the inside along the final termination. Then the Green Six of Baron Scroop and Osiris Allah. Followed through by Resurgent Gift a little bit wider. Social Butterfly and Chatterbury Altos. And as they get to the second of the eight. Cycle glass that leads over them. Again, another shot from our new commentary box here, ready for next week's festival. Drilling has stopped. So we get some clear comms. The last race here today. Before I hand you over to Doncaster and Martin to call them home. But cycle glass has got about a six, seven length advantage now from the big easy final termination and tornadoes. Pushing through his barren scroop. He's got Osiris Allap and social butterfly. Resurgent Gift and Chatterbury Altos, pretty much the same as the start, the mile and a quarter still to go. So the stellar handicap hurdles being led by Cycle Glass. Through the woods, takes over the third and skip over that nicely. So Cycle Glass with six seventh lead length advantage from the Big Easy and Tornidos. Final termination, Paul Rhodes on the inside. Baron Scroop, Cyrus Allah. Is a resurgent gift, and just to the rear social butterfly and chatterberry altos. So cycle glass leads them over the fourth. Halfway through the hurdles, they will take that quite well. Social butterfly is a little bit sticky on landing. The cycle glass is lead now. It's cut down to about three as the big easy moves towards him. And Baron's group and final termination coming along for the ride. And this cycle glass though. Just being pushed along now to hang on to his lead inside the six. Now, oh, and we've lost one there. Resurgent Gift's gone for Paul O'Neill. Unlucky. Mistake there, and he's fallen. But up front inside the five, it's Cycle Glass from Big Easy. Baron's group and final termination. Tornidos running on well now from the back. It's going to be between these fives. We lose Osiris Ally, Social Butterfly, and Chatterbury Altos. But up front is still Cycle Glass with the Big Easy just cruising on his outside along with Baron's group just behind those is final termination with nowhere to go Tornidos is still running on social butterflies come out of nowhere as we go over the six three from home and it's cycle glass still got a length advantage from the big easy and Baron's group Tornidos on the out wide outside running on really well don't think final termination's got a lot left but up front it's all changed Baron's group leads by half a length to go over the penultimate from the big easy Tornidos on the outside moving back in again the game is cycle glass but Baron's group leads by a length now from the big easy on Tornadoes running now well is final termination they're going to have to do a bit to catch this leader Baron Scroop's got a length and a half advantage from the Big Easy Tornadoes out wide final termination as we get down to the last is Baron Scroop gets over it well Baron Scroop leads by length and a half only got half a furlong to go and it's going to be Baron Scroop that's going to take this from I think final termination running on well into second Big Easy was third Tornadoes downhill French was fourth so it's a good win there for Baron Scroop sure whose silks that is. It's either going to be Thomas Rogers or possibly Craig Allen. Not sure. Similar silks. But Baron's group has taken it. And for James Shea, got it completely wrong. Well done, James. Takes that one from final termination of Paul Rhodes in second. Third was Big Easy for Joshua Sutton. Fourth was Tornadoes for Daniel French. And fifth was Cycle Glass, our long-time leader for Derek Hinton. I hand you over to Martin.